welcome back to Machine Art Channel and if you're joining us for the first time, welcome! Today on this channel, we'll be talking about rapid transfer. What is rapid transfer? Do you receive money from the bank even when you don't have a bank account? Or you receive money with a bank? that you don't even have an account with sometimes if that is possible and if you do send money to people in other countries that don't have a bank account or to a particular bank that they don't even bank with then you would have sent that money through rapid transfer. Now, what are some of the instances? Before I tell you what rapid transfer is all about and how you can go about it in the bank, there are instances where a person doesn't have a domiciliary account. You know that some of the universally accepted currency that you can have an account to be able to deposit and transfer such currencies in your own account are dollar, euro, and pounds, right? But coming to look at it, what if you want to send money to a person living in Kenya, Uganda, Jamaica, Chile, Ghana, Mali, Benin Republic, Togo, and so on and so forth. Maybe Senegal, maybe Cote d'Ivoire. How do you go about it? What if the person is in Brazil and the person doesn't have a domiciliary account? Then you want to be able to send this money so that the person can receive the money in his or her local currency. Not just in dollars. How do you go about it? Then another thing is, what if you want to travel to, let's say, Cote d'Ivoire, or you want to travel to Chile, or any other country do you need to have a hard currency that you need to have cash maybe convert your money to dollars because you are so scared that when you don't have dollars to go and exchange to their local currency then you may not be able to survive in that place the answer is absolutely no. You can go to the bank using your local currency, send that money from your home country to the other country and do what? And once you get to that country, make your means of verification and know the secret question and answer and just cash your money meaning that aside from maybe your passport voter's card and so on and so forth and just knowing the secret question and answer you don't need to carry money to the country you are going to yet you will go to their bank collect the money then you can have the money in cash or you can have a bank account with that bank and deposit the local currency even if it was dollars you transfer there you will be able to do it you will be able to exchange the money to the local currency all right transfer or Western Money Union, Money, Western 
money union transfer. What is Western money union transfer or rapid transfer? Rapid transfer is just a simple process where you transfer currency or funds to a person through a bank who may be living in a country to receive that money in local currency in Europe, in even dollars in the country without having a bank account where you necessarily send the money to. But when you finish sending the money, take for instance, you are in Nigeria and you want to send money to Ghana. If the money you're sending is like 100,000 or 500,000 Naira, that's Nigerian currency, the money will be calculated if you want the person in Ghana to receive that money in Ghana City, the money will be converted from the bank to Ghana City. We know the equivalent figure of the amount of money that person in Ghana to be received in Ghana currency. for the conversion. If Ghana City is more than Naira, all they need to do is to tell you how much in Naira Ghana City, Ghana City was. If you will receive in dollars, all they need to tell you is how much Naira then they will divide the money you want to send that person by that amount and you will have exactly the currency the person is supposed to be received. Now, if the local currency you want to send to the person is more than the currency of the people living in that country, then all you need to know or all the bank will tell you is how much the local currency was when exchanged to the other currency. Let us say that you're sending Naira and one Naira is equivalent to 1.8 trillion pesos. That is, one Naira is like almost two times the equivalent of Chilean pesos. When you're sending 100,000 Naira, the money in Chile may be the equivalent of 180,000 Chilean pesos because you will do the conversion by timesing one naira or the equivalent of the money you're sending by one eight. Then you will have the amount you'll be receiving. So you see, going by this explanation, when you want to do a rapid transfer, because you're traveling to another country. Let's say a lot of Nigerians, and even I in time past, when I was in the university, I go to countries like Benin Republic from Nigeria, and I go to Togo in order to make purchases, to come back and sell in my home country, in Nigeria. What I used to do back then was, to go to the bank where I'm having a bank account or where I'm not having a bank account. 
do a rapid transfer and tell them the source of verification I will be using. When I get to that home country, to that country, sorry, when I get to that country, I will take my means of verification as I told the bank. Then the secret question and answer that you need to do it, you need to know that the bank would have told you. You will go there, get a form from the bank, you get to the form, and walk to the very bank that this bank told you they would be sending the money to. You can walk into any of their branch and simply tell them that you are here to cash your money through rapid transfer. The money was sent or that you transferred the money through rapid transfer. They will give you a form, then you fill the form and collect your cash. So do you see how easy it is? Meaning, you don't have to go and begin to look for a way to change your money to dollars. Because in your own country, as you knew that you were traveling, you converted the money to dollars and you were having cash. If you have a domiciliary account, you see that you will not need to go to an ATM where they have a domiciliary account or even go to their central bank and try to go and change the money to the local currency using your dollars or going to the central bank and trying to change your local currency back to their own local currency in central bank or during the change in order for you to spend your money right that's what rapid transfer is rapid transfer favors travelers and if there is a way which i will find out and on this youtube platform i'll also teach you how to carry out a rapid transfer by yourself without going to the bank then even when you are in the home country that other com that other country you will be able to use your computer or your phone anytime carry out a rapid transfer just walk into the bank or your bank cash the money after cashing the money in their local currency you can choose to deposit the money in your account so there are many instances there are many banking transactions that one needs to learn in order to operate in a cashless society. You want to say 100 million of that currency, 200 million, 5,000, 2,000, 100,000, 500 million, and so on and so forth. You can do it through rapid transfer and go absolutely without the cash, without worrying about the money you're carrying, and without worrying about how you go and get the money, or go and fill some forms, do this, do this, exchange, do that. Even though you can do it, rapid transfer is also direct. Just go to the country, go to the bank that this bank in your home country told you they were getting the money to. Get that form, fill that form, the means of verification as you told the bank in your home country and verify. Boom! The money will be given to you and you will have your money to spend. That's what rapid transfer or Western Union money transfer is about. You don't need to have an account to receive money from the bank through rapid transfer or Western Union.
your transfer. Don't have to connect him with that particular bank in order to go to that bank and receive your money if the money has been sent to the bank. Now that you know what, rapid transfer or what Western Money Union or Western Union Money Transfer is all about. Please, if the video was helpful, give this video a thumbs up, share with your loved ones, and subscribe to the channel for more uploads. Thank you.